obviously for a pretty funny story. Did, did you talk to him much about the USC thing that happened? Nah, not at all. Actually, uh, one of my friends uh, just texted me right before practice and said, did your dad get like a fake USC offer or something like that? And I was like, I haven't heard anything about it really, so. <laughs> Could you ever imagine playing against your dad as a coach? <laughs> I think it would be pretty unfair since, you know, Coach Hofers and Coach Kelly always let him come to our practices and let him, you know, look at our playbook and things like that. I think it would be pretty messed up for him to then go around and coach another team after after all that. Are you going to give him a call now after, after <laughs> hearing about that? Uh, nah, I'm not even really concerned about it. <laughs> what was it like for you getting back on the field for Colorado? It was good, you know. It was, uh, I had the butterflies that you usually have, like, for your first game, so it was good to have that. Because, you know, it's been a few weeks and you're in the making and everything. So it definitely felt good just back out there, you know, doing what I love and being out there with my friends, you know, just playing ball. Feel rusty or is it kind of? Yeah, definitely a little rusty. Not rusty in the sense that, you know, I was, you know, played bad. But just, you know, this game, a game, you can't simulate the game, you know, no matter how hard you practice. It's still going to be a little bit different. So everybody needs to get there and get that first hit and that first, you know, first time getting the ball and things like that. What have you, I know you guys treat every game the same. But now that you've been here for a couple of years, you've seen the, the rivalry, at least from a fan perspective, of Washington and Oregon. What have you seen out of the rivalry? How much have you grown to appreciate it? Uh, I think it's definitely a fan thing. I mean, from, from my point of view, I feel like the players really just respect each other. We respect their players. I'm pretty sure they respect us as well. The fans, it's a different thing. The fans, you know, hate each other and talk and do all that thing. But I mean, for us, we just go out there and just play really hard. And you know, we respect all our opponents, especially them. You go out there and just play, and I hate to say it, but it's just another game. <laughs> what, uh, what have you seen out of my film so far out of their defenses? Oh, they've they're got, the defense yeah, defense. very good defensive backs, very physical guys. You know, they fly to the ball, they, you know, they're physical, they tackle well. And then, you know, I just, I watched a little bit of their game on the plane, and so, you know, Keith Price is obviously a very good player, and, you know, their offense is pretty dynamic, so it's going to be a very good matchup.